Now we're going to uh, extract a whole bunch of tables based on criteria, things that we are looking for. And to extract the table means we duplicate it, and then we just take out the data that we're looking for. We're going to duplicate the sheet tab, renaming the new sheet tab non-spenders. Okay, so I like to usually take and copy, going back to my file, I go to website traffic, I, you know, let's start on cell A1, and so I'll put my pointer on cell A1, I'm going to right click where it says web traffic, I'm going to duplicate it, and I'm going to give the tab a different name by right clicking and then clicking on rename. It told me to call it non spenders. And then I click OK. Going back to my directions, give it a red tab color. Doing that. Right click on the tab, go to tab color, and pick a red color. Going back to my directions, in the non spenders tab, I'm going to create a filter for the records where the transaction completed is equal to no. That means I'm going to put a check mark only on the no choice. Back at my spreadsheet, I go to my transaction completed column, pull down the arrow, go to filter, select everything, and just select no, and then click OK. I'm then going to change the, tab, the table grid color to red. To do that, I go to where it says design for table tools and I pick a red color. I'm going to return to the website traffic sheet and duplicate the sheet tab again. This time I'm going to call it customers. I'm going to give that tab a yellow color. Again, I'm going to right click where it, click on website traffic first, then right click, click rename or duplicate, right click, rename, type in customers, click OK. Right click customers, change the tab color to yellow. In the customers table, I'm going to create a filter for the records where the transaction completed this time is equal to yes. So in my customers table, going to transaction completed. Filter, select all, this time I'm picking yes, and everybody there spent money. Going back to my directions, I want to change the color of the table to yellow. Again, go to design, and pick a yellow color. I repeat this process again in number 10. I'm going to duplicate the web traffic sheet. I'm going to call it big spenders. Again, go to web traffic, the original table that you started off with. Right click, duplicate. 
right click, rename, type in big spenders, click OK. I'm going to now right click and pick a green tab color. And you can probably guess what's going to happen with the color of the table, but we'll get to that in a minute. For now, we want to filter the records where the transactions completed equal yes, and the transaction amount is over $2,000. Then we're going to change that grid color to green. First, the first part. What we do, go up here and go to filter. Again, select all and then yes. This shows us everybody that spent money. Then we go to transaction amount, click the down arrow key. This time we go to numbers filter and we say greater than. Now remember, we want everybody that spent more than $2,000. So we type in 2000, no commas or dollar signs, and we click OK. So these people spent more than $2,000. These are our big spenders. We want to take care of these people. All right. Next, you guessed it. We're going to go to design and change the table color to green. 